As their cities grew bigger, so did our need for energy. From fossil fuels to nuclear, we harvested it all. We always knew the day would come when we would run out. We just never realized how soon that would be. Greed, mismanagement, waste, corruption. The end result was inevitable. It was only a matter of time until we depleted our energy resources. With nowhere to turn to and no one to save us, our once great civilization began to collapse. The energy wars, brutal as they were, was only the beginning. There simply wasn't enough energy to power the technology we had come to depend on. Some say the universe spared us. Some say it was divine intervention, a strange wormhole forming just outside our solar system. An entire planet emerged from the anomaly. Scientists confirmed it as an ocean planet. We named this planet Delta Athene. Deep space scans revealed an abundance of zero-point energy crystals. It would seem our salvation had arrived from the void. Perhaps, for the first time in history, the human race united as one. United with a single purpose. A new world government was formed as the United Federation of Nations. We had no choice. Harvest the energy from this mysterious planet or perish. Our best minds were gathered at the newly formed UFN Space Exploration Center. We had to construct a spaceship capable of atmospheric flight, capable of supporting science missions, harvesting energy, research and development on Delta Athene. An initial energy harvesting expedition to the planet confirmed the abundance of these zero-point energy crystals. An unexpected gift from the universe, we saw a new golden age of humanity just over the horizon. We should have known. Nothing is ever truly as it appears. Some unknown sentience protects this planet. Silently observing us from the depths of the ocean, it tracked our every move. Waiting. Waiting for the perfect moment to strike. This planet is uninhabited, we thought. We thought wrong. We planned for dangers. But nothing so relentless and ruthless as these monsters. We thought our technology was superior. We thought our weapons could hold them back. Little did we know, a destructive force like none we have ever encountered before. Our energy harvesting platforms fell to the waves of Kraken, one by one. Still, there was hope. We quickly mobilized our greatest scientific minds, who discovered various defenses against the Kraken. And so, the Defense Task Force was born. We noticed a pattern in the Kraken attacks. At first, younger and weaker creatures would attack. Then, as we held off the first attacks, stronger monsters would follow. The waves of Kraken becoming stronger and stronger until our platforms are destroyed.
As commander of our new initiative, your mission is to defend our platforms. The fate of our planet rests in your capable hands. Good luck, Commander.